Hello everyone. Today we're going to repair a Model A starter. Now, the last time I drove this car, this happened to it. The starter drive isn't contacting. So, I'm going to take it apart and see if I can figure out what's wrong with it. Okay, I think I know what's wrong with that. Now this drive gear, it's got this thing on the back of it that's supposed to be attached solid, and when it's turning to get towards the flywheel, it's jamming. Because if I hold it in place, now it turns freely. This is definitely a problem we're going to have to address. Now on these lock washers, the proper thing to do would be to bend this open, but usually if I can force it loose enough, it'll just push itself out of the way. Like that. I'm going to replace it all anyway. I took the other screw out, and I discovered this thing's broken here, too. So, this is shot. The spring is still good, so I'm probably going to save that. So I bought a new starter drive. It was only about 25 bucks. And there it is, complete. The new starter drive it has the hardware. The washers are not bent, and the bolts were just hand tight. So I tightened this one down. Now the way these washers are supposed to go is one side gets bent down on the spring. The other side, after you tighten the bolt down, it gets bent up against the head, so it can't turn. This is the one for the other side. Goes on there like so. I've seen people install these various different ways. In fact, one time I saw one where somebody bent both of the tabs up against the bolt head. Do not do that. That's not going to prevent the bolt from backing loose. But this is the proper way. One side down towards a spring, the other side on the bolt head. I bought a new key while we're at it, just because I could. And now this part.
these are kind of tricky because the key always wants to back out when installing it. Line it up with the low spot on the armature and turn this part around until the spring lines up with that. And then this bolt goes in it with the lock washer. And that's it. It's good to go. So while the starter was off, this was a good opportunity to clean this part of the engine. Alright, everything hooked back up. Let's see if it works. It works perfectly. Well, that was easy to fix. Well, that's it for now. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.